Welcome back, everyone. We're going to get Warlord Silver Chance this time, I promise. Right after I pick this lock again. Um, anyway, last time we tried. We tried our darndest. <coughs> ah, pardon me. Really bad cough there. Um, just came in all, all of a sudden. Anyway, turns out Bleaty is pretty cheaty. I liked my elf idea. Having maximum mana is pretty good. Gnome's probably actually better. Why aren't I going as Gnome? I went as Gnome Paladin when it didn't make sense. <sighs> Let's go as Gnome Paladin, or Gnome Warlord. You know, because Gnome is just so good at everything. Her, 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 her. Anyway, Gnomes can make, you know, mana potions. Very important. Going with mana boosters, I think it makes the most sense, but, you know, Flame Magnet's also not too bad. But we're going to be spending most of our mana on Sidestep. I'm a wall and wait what if we can find it. Black Market, but being able to buy everything's good. Make sure you choose your potion before hitting that little buy button, though. Alright, yes, he looks like the Gnome Knight from Adventure Time. Awesome. Uh, anyway, one of the key mechanics of this level is that the enemies turn into Revenant Sheep when you uh, kill them. Um, I don't know. Okay, yeah, I think I do know. I think that's what I will do. Is I will start worshiping Earth Mother right away. Do I need to? It doesn't really make sense not to. Let's do it when we actually decide we're going to turn somebody into stone. And then we'll use Death Protection, finish him off. See, he turns into a Revenant Goat. Does max damage. Um, the only way to kill him is if you have a death protection or if he's slowed. And you gotta make sure you can one shot him. So, yeah. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna, you know, worship her, pick up that I'm a wall. Yeah, it's good stuff. And we are going to death protection ourselves. And we're gonna kill. Uh, let's grab this too. We're gonna kill the goo blob because I don't like getting weakened. Okay? I just don't. And then he'll also turn into a revenant. Spoiler alert. And boom. And the revenants act just like the revenants in the other place. They follow you around. So this one is not on top of any blood. We're going to turn him into stone. This is going to help with our bonus EXP, by the way. So, you know, there, that's something. That's something. Um, let's get the other one off of the blood, too. Because, you know, I'm going to need blood for plantation, whatever that thing is called that I do with Earth Mother. A pretty awesome thing. Um, let's look for a level three. Doop -a doop -a do Looking ah, here we go. Not quite what I was looking for though. That physical resist will mess me up something fierce. Uh, let's find somebody else. Well, actually, if I can get a little more, if I get a little more HP, you know, then he'll be take onable. Pissorf might use it, might not. In fact, I might just use it to. You know, push that guy off of the, off of the thing, off of the blood. Um, let's do that. Boom. Excellent. And you know, it's safe to turn him into stone right here. Yeah. All right. Second thing. Second. Ah. Okay. Here we go. Now we can take on the goo blob. Goo. Do I keep saying glue blob? I feel like that's what I'm saying. And I apologize if that is indeed the case. But you know, that's just how I talk. Anyway. One thing that we can do is we can start spending our piety kind of early. I don't know if green blood is the right way to go because I don't know if it'll corrosion things that aren't here. So let's, I think you always get Earth Mother here, by the way, because she's so useful. Anyway, green blood time. Um, boom. This is mostly the test. We'll find out if an enemy I haven't uncovered yet is, okay, now he's three sharp. So that, that makes me happy. That makes me really happy. Um, We'll find out with another mob we uncover if he is corroded or whatever. So we'll hit, hit, um, barely win. All right. Don't turn him into stone yet. It's not worth it. Okay. Well, let's see here. Um, okay. So we are gradually leveling up, getting death protection out of the way. We, uh, use corrosion. We're gonna see if any enemies that were weren't on the mat weren't on the radar yet have succumbed to its delicious charms. Let's find out. 
This guy's three shotable. If I had a little more damage, I could totally take him on. In fact, I think I might be able to. Smack, smack, death protection, smack. Yeah, that'll work. That'll work. Uh, let's try it. Smack, smack, death protection, smack. Sweet. Okay. This revenant should be off of any blood. So we'll go ahead and do that to him. Ten whole piety is good stuff. It's great stuff. It's wonderful stuff. Um, we're going to need our death protection back. Thank you very much. Hmm, more gold. Don't mind if I do. Now let's see. Um, yeah, experience booster. That's, that's good. I don't think we can take on a level 7 Gorgon yet. I'm sorry, but that's just the case. Uh, I'm back, you stupid person. Fellow goats, come swiftly to the aid of your lord. Okay, yeah. So don't attack him. Bleedy is cheaty. And he's corroded, so we can totally use, um, you know, whatever this is, uh, green blood. Uh, it only creates three plants. That's good. Doesn't cost a lot of piety. That's also good. Um, don't know if it's going to help us all that much. But w what we also want to use Earth Mother for is this entanglement. To entangle all the goats and then finish them off when we need to. Or something along those lines. Um, there's an enemy right there and I can't even see it. Oh, here's a level four. Okay. But I might get blocked in by a goat. That might be bad. So how do we how do we do this? Well, one way is to ensure our victory and turn him into stone, but then that blocks off this darkness possibly. So we gotta think ahead on that. Um, another idea is we'll just take on the snake. We won't use our death protection, I don't think. And then we'll just use our death protection to take him out, yeah. Sounds like an idea. And then boom. Okay, uh, I don't want to turn him to stone there. Uh, and we're poisoned too, so we're going to need to kill somebody. Uh, this guy sounds pretty good. Because... Oh, hang on, let's see. I'll kill him. Hopefully the goat will appear here or here. It'll leave it open still somewhat. Oh, wow, there's three goats now. Um, okay, it's fine with me. Fine with me if it's fine with you. Okay, we're level four now. This is a little more difficult without Wait Wet being able to put them wherever I want to put them at. But, you know, sometimes you just gotta live with things. Okay, found level six. Um, if I had a little more damage. Or if I could corrosion him a bit. Gotta be careful, though. If we corrosion too much, the plants might get in the way. And they're starting to already bottleneck somewhat, so... Let's see. Um... <clears throat> I'm doing 33 per, so if I would have to put on three more stacks of corrosion in order to make this work, could I even afford that? Barely, I think. Hmm. 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 This is getting a little difficult. I will admit to that. Well, let's see. Smack him. Smack him. And then, yeah, I, I, I can actually take him on. But then, these two goats might pile on right here. Yeah, I gotta be careful about that. Gotta be careful about that. What I think I'll do is I'll just use my uh, death protection to take one of them out. Boom. The end. And is it safe to I'm a wall here? He's not covering up any blood. It's just I hate creating bottlenecks. So I'm gonna say no for now. Just for now. And we're we're not poisoned, right? Good. We're not poisoned. Okay. Let's heal up. We can afford to. We got darkness. We got this, guys. We're we're in the bank. Um, this shouldn't be too bad now. Okay, death protection and finish him off. Yes. And it was pretty good to have uh, that bonus EXP thing too. All right. All right. I'm. I feel like just recycling it now. So let's do that. In fact, let's pick up all our potions in case they get covered up by something like plants. Plants can be pretty bad about that. Um, let's get our death protection back, please. And I can safely turn that into stone. Well, let's let's let's, let's uh, do a bit of exploration here. Um, am I mana burned? No, I just used my my death protection, so it used all my MP. Yay! Thanks, Priority. 
Um, now the problem is, you know, we got to get rid of all the enemies before we even start fighting Bleedy or he cheats. And getting rid of the enemies also means I can turn them into stone. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. We'll see if that helps. It might. It just might. Um, I guess if we can get a little more mana like that, we'll probably take on this guy. Sounds good to me. Let's do it. As you smack, smack. Yeah, I think this will work out. And then death protection. So. Very good. Very good. Uh, Could have gone a little bit better, but you know, I think it's working. Let's get one more square. Actually, you know, I don't care about grabbing three whole squares. And let's freeze the one that's not on the blood. Yeah. Last time I had the balanced dagger too. That was really helping too. My only slip up was attacking Ble Bleaty too early. Um, what am I killing now? Maybe this level 7. Yeah, I can totally take on the level 7. And boom. Yeah. Alright, excellent. And we'll turn his cohort into stone. Into stone. And leave it alone. You turn it into stone. And you kill them. Get extra EXP. Do do do. I don't know. Bloody Tears is a good song, but I'm butchering it. Alright. Who else? Who else wants some? Smack, smack. I can take on a level 8, guys. I don't know if you appreciate the gravity of the, what this means, but yeah. I'm going to get a ton of EXP, and it's going to be swell. Um, getting close. Um, let's do it. Do it. Death protection. Do it. Yeah. Okay, get our death protection back. Get that back. Um... This is going to block off the corridor if I turn him into stone, so let's not. I'm thinking ahead for once. <coughs> Pardon me again. I've been speaking for a while, so my voice is starting to, you know, die a little. <laughs> but that's okay. It's, it's going all right. Um, a level 7 would be perfect. A level 9? I might be able to squeeze in a level 9. Um, I would much rather turn a goat into stone. So what I think I'll do is I'll kill this guy and then we will turn the level 8 into stone because you know I, I feel like it's going to be harder to deal with him later. Okay, now we have our EXP boost. That's mostly what I was after. EXP boost is good. EXP is one of those things that you absolutely need in, you know, fights. Um, or dungeons, rather, all over. Um, would it be better to take on level 8? Almost. I feel like the snake is a better deal for our, our buck. So we'll do that. We'll, we'll take him on. Um, boom. Boom. Sidestep. Boom. Okay. I'm almost trapped. I'm somehow skipping past this darkness uh, unveiling it. That's, that's hilarious. Let's get our de death protection back. Okay. Um... I don't want to say it's time to turn them into slow yet. Hmm. I'm level 7. I think I was ready to take on Bleedy at level 8 earlier, but, you know, let's uncover everything first. Let's go exploring. Okay, there's three of these little guys. Um, we got we to gotta take care of them or something. Uh, I think I'd rather spend five piety just to get rid of three goats. And it'll also slow everything else too. So that, that's that's good. That's good nature right there. Let's uh, let's do that. Worship. Entanglement. Yeah. Made five plants, but you know we'll be getting rid of them soon enough. Okay. Um. So let's for sure get rid of this one. And I think we'll turn this one into stone safely enough. Well, no. Let's kill this one. And then we'll turn him to stone right here. Yes. Okay. That's my alarm telling me that I'm doing something dumb. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, and now let's try and take on, I don't know, level 8. I don't like the meat men. No surprise there, is it? Uh, I think we'll take on the Gorgon. Boom. And then boom. And... 
I think I'll just safely turn you into stone. Yeah, I'm covering up some blood. It's all right. It's all right. It's doing good. It's doing good work. Doing good jobs. Um, let's get death protection back. Thanks. And what's this? Tower shield. Done with the care. Physical protection won't help against bleedy. Okay. That 100% death gaze matters. Anyway, we're level seven still. And we have our uh, we have our bonus EXP. I think if we can, we really should just try and take on the Meat Man. Uh huh. And then we'll just kind of sort of region fight him. I think we're barely winning. Okay, good, good, good. If I got one more square, that put him out of my kill radius. Yeah, yeah. Well, let's use our MP on something. But what? But what? I don't know what. Let's let's be careful about this. Uh, let's just kill him, cause you know I'm done with his shenanigans. And I don't know what to say here. I think I'll kill this Naga. No. Um. I'm thinking about how to get this. Well, okay. I might get pulled into something. So I'm going to have to be careful here. I think I'll kill this Naga. Yeah. Yeah, that, that worked. And then we'll just turn this one into stone. And, oh, we're full of piety. So let's, uh, let's, let's do something about that. Green blood. How are we looking? Not too bad. Another green blood. Yeah, okay. Everyone gets acided. A bunch. Might help in the end. We'll see. What else was I doing? Oh yeah, get my death protection back. <clears throat> Don't want to waste my death protection taking out a level 1 goat. Maybe I'll use Burndurass to take out the low level goats. Boom. Yeah. It's good to me. Good for me, whatever I mean to say. Um, this guy is going to be in the way. So we're gonna kill him. And we're gonna burn him. Yeah. Burn Draz is actually pretty good. Uh banana mana. Might help. Not gonna not gonna judge it yet. Certainly not gonna judge it yet. Okay, but the key is that I'm gonna need to kill every enemy here. Or this isn't gonna work. Um I guess we're just gonna try and keep leveling or something. Um Boom. And yeah, yeah, that'll work. It's it's working, okay? Wanna fight? Don't mind if I do. Uh, let's summon them. Okay, so he's the only there's no level eights. Okay, maybe there's level eights, but they're all slowed now. Okay. Well maybe I'll use it to kill the sheep more easily, I don't know. We'll see. And win. All right, excellent. I guess I'll turn him to stone. I mean, it's nine piety. I know it's supposed to be ten, but I'm ruining it, okay? And I like ruining it. Let's... Let's see here. I need enough mana to burn resulting goats. And then burn, okay. And now let's do a little exploration, and then we'll kill another one. Yeah, okay. It's good. I, I'm liking how this is going. You know, I, earlier I was a little intimidated, but now I think it's working. Uh, whoops, I didn't mean to level, but whatever. I'm not attacking Bleedy until, you know, everybody else is dead. Okay, and so far I'm liking the plan. Um, all out of MP for burning. Burning durassing. That's a verb. Who said it wasn't? Okay, we're winning. We're winning. We're winning. We're winning. Mm, yeah, I'll kill you. And I wonder if the message changes because, you know, with that one Naga or whatever, it was like she calls for her army but no one comes or something. I wonder what it's going to save for the goat. Because, you know, this, this is going pretty good. Just cleaning up here. 
Um, I'm thinking about more green blood. In case I turn anybody else into stone. Five stacks of corrosion. Not bad. It could be better. Could be better. Um, I'm going to turn... No. I'm going to turn him into stone when he comes on down here. Yeah. Uh, this way is almost blocked off. And it will be blocked off if that blood turns into a tree. Weird statement, I know. Um, but I still want to turn him into stone. I feel like I'm giving up some piety here. Okay. And then we'll kill you. And... I need that guy dead. Okay, so there's no other way into this enemy chamber here. Except destroying a plant. You know, and I'll... I'll well... I might need to use a clearance. Or I might need to spend some piety, <laughs> so to speak. Um, destroying that plant. I know, it's going to be painful, but whatever. I need all the enemies dead. Uh-huh. Um, let's see. This is going to be a little difficult. How come you didn't warp on over? Oh, well, whatever. Um, I'll think of something. Oh, such something I will think of. I think... He's going to kill me. And yet, if I just had a little more MP. Dang. Okay. Well, fine. Fine. I'm going to have to drink. Or I'm going to have to kill. What would be better? I don't know. Let's drink a meta potion. Yeah. And then we will piss off him. Will that kill him? Yeah, it will. And in fact, it'll break open a wall. That's good. And I like walls being open. I better look at stores before they get covered. I think I might want the War Garble. Or the Fine Sword. Both seem pretty good, actually. Um, I think I've done one of fighting. Just how it is. And I think I'll go at the War Garble. Just cause. Just cause. No. Well, yeah. Yes. Let's let's be part of the solution, not part of the problem. Anyway, where was I going with this? I am still killing all the enemies. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. That is indeed what I'm doing. Do I have my death section? Now I do. And I think I just spent the last of the darkness. So we better make sure we kill this meat man. Um, barely alive. Okay. And then we'll just burn him to death. Cool. Um, I'm level 10. That's, that's pretty impressive, actually. Uh, let's use one more corrosion just so I can one-shot that goblin down here. Yeah. I'd say that was worth it. And, uh, who else exists? These meat men and this goo blob. Mm-hmm. Okay. I, I can totally, I can deal with this. Um, the goats are starting to worry me a bit. Yeah, try saying that again. Um, how do I get in there? Is that guy just cut off from the world? Okay, well, I have an idea of my own. What we're going to do is we are going to clearance. And we're going to shove this. Yeah, I still have my piss off. Good. I'm going to shove this guy into that wall. Piss orf. And piss... Oh. I did it all wrong. Or maybe I did it just fine. I think I think I can still make this work. Push. Okay. I think that killed him. Alright. Found the goblin. Um... Gonna kill it. And I feel like being careful about this. Because, you know, I'm, I'm running low on uh, stuff here. Can I kill them both? No. No, I can't. Oh, well. Whatever. Um, we're going to need to get rid of these ghosts here soon, though. Anyway. There's three whole goats. They might surround me here. I, I, I got 
gotta do this careful. Um, I guess we're gonna take out the goats by slowing them. Uh, entanglement, please. That adds a lot of plants for how much pie do you spend, but you know, it's something. Boom, and kachoon. Okay, good. Very good. We're doing good work here. I think I can kill him just on merit alone. And... Don't know how I feel about this. I think I might just use five piety to get rid of them both. All right. Ah, uh, he's he's actually kind of winning there. Let's be careful about this. Okay. Now I can win. Boom. Boom. All right. I'm blocked in, aren't I? Of course I am. Of course I am. Will Pissorf kill him? No. How about now? No? Okay, then. Uh, I guess these are indestructible walls or something. Um, we're going to have to burn one of them. But just one of them. This one. Yes. Okay, we're doing good. Um, I, I'd like to think we're doing good. Let's use clearance. And now we'll come down and... Well, let's just use entanglement. And now we can kill him. So, any more enemies? I don't think I see any. Okay, good. Um, what else am I doing? Green blood is pretty expensive. Vine blood is actually fairly pointless against the boss. So I think I think we're good. I think we're good. How much for our next clearance, by the way? Fifteen. Okay. I can deal with it, and I'll show you how I can deal with it. Oh, I didn't have my death protection. Um. All right. In that case, let me turn something to stone. Like, I don't know, this guy? Yeah, five piety. Woohoo. And now we will clearance. Good. And now everything's nice and clear. And we can start our killing of this guy. Or something. I'm not sure where I was going with that. Um, right, let's, let's convert everything we're not using. And in fact... I'm thinking if yeah, let's let's get to the apothecary and buy that Schadenfreude. Ah, it's good stuff. Let me show you why. Um, we'll smack him. Yeah. At least I think it'll work. I kind of hope it will. Oh well. Let's find out. I think I'm done with Pissorf. Good. Um, this Iron Wall is not going to give me anything. Burndraz I might still use. Let's smack him. As you strike bleed, he lets out a mighty bellow. The dungeon's remaining dozens turn to stone and crumble to dust as he draws upon their life power. This is one freaky goat you're dealing with. He... It didn't give me a second message. There was nothing there. Okay. Well, fine with me. Boom. And... I meant to use my Shadden for it. Oh, well. We'll use it here in a minute. Um... Plantation! Boom! 170 piety, guys! I wish there was a way to capture all that, but oh well. Clarence again. Okay. And then we will drink our Schadenfreude. And then we'll hit him. Yeah. Filled up on MP. Love it. It's better than two mana potions. In fact, it's about worth two and a half mana potions if you think about it. Even better if you're an elf. Um, except maybe not if you're a blood mage. Let's just finish him. I'm, I'm done here, you know. I either completely kick the dungeon's ass, or I completely get kicked out of the dungeon, so whatever. Um, the Tri-Sword? What's that? Plus two damage, forged by some strange alchemy. How are you even holding this? Charges five degenerating base damage whenever you quaff a potion. Quaff is a fancy word for drink, don't you know? I don't want any more plants down here, so yeah. Let's pick it up. It takes up a whole space that's cool I mean not very cool but maybe that's the claw I've been looking at on the front screen I don't know we'll find out cool well this got me my warlord silver challenge and that's good that's very good dealt with you bleedy the cheaty woot woot sauce and that was my last silver challenge of the classic jobs next up is I guess tinker or something Task complete, use death protection. 50 gold, woohoo. 
Petrify enemies, 50 gold. Yep. Terror grows. The torment is not at an end. You can feel it. Bleedy remains imprinted on you, but at least your efforts have earned you the legendary trisword. This blade defies description as its very form is constantly shifting to alter perceptions and reality through elusive magic and alchemy. I like it. I like it. I wish I had one. Um, alright. I guess I can, you know, equip it? Yeah. Whoops. Um, cool. I, I have a trisword. Yeah! And I can wield it in both hands and in my teeth. Uh, never mind. I, I just made somebody out there hate me. I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, cool. This has been Captain Thief playing Desktop Dungeons. I will see you guys in the next one.